So let's start to look how to update in Chart.js for the data. So the first thing what we need to do is we need to get a border template, which you can find here on chartjs3.com getting started. In this link, you can find as well in the description box. So once you're on here, scroll down and copy this chunk of code. We're going to paste that in there. And then we're going to put that in here, save, refresh. All right, so now we have this here. So how would we be able to update, for example, our data here? I want this uh, weekly sales of number 18 being updated. To update this, all we need to do is we need to understand how we access this object here, which is the data object. And then what we're going to do is the following. We're going to say here, first of all, the my chart constant so i'm going to go in there and then from there on we go into the data object and then if we want to update specifically number 18 so from data object we go to the data sets and this data sets index zero so we're going to grab this here dot data sets index zero and then we say a dot what exactly do we want to adjust the data and then number 18 for example so you say data index zero that's the first one and instead of 18 we'll make this 24 save that refresh and of course you don't see it yet the reason why you don't see this yet is we didn't update it so we're going to say here my chart dot update to update the data that we have save refresh and now as you can see we have updated it and we can do the same for example, for a background color. So how do we do that? We can just copy the same code here and then just look at it. So let's say we want to have a new background color or this black background color. We want to implement this as well on the red one here. All we have to do is we have to go from data to data sets and the background color, which is an array. So index number zero. Scroll down, go and say here background color. And then we're going to put in here the string variable. I think there's already a, there's a quotation like that. And there we are. Save this, refresh. Now, as you can see, the color has been changed. It changes from red to black because it first loads the red one and then immediately it understands the update here and then it loads or converts the red color into a black color. And that's it.